Hello and welcome back everyone to Plants vs Zombies 2. Today I'll be giving you a penny's pursuit strategy and I learned it from Shailendra Singh so huge shout out to him cause frankly I would never have figured this one out on my own. So yeah, major shout out to Shailendra Singh. What are those endangered plants? I I've never seen them. Okay, so you need this. Okay, this is the perk that you need. Base Blast. Frankly, I'm... I, uh, they just keep adding new plants. I think I need to look into it. I'll probably do it after I show you how to do this. Right, so... What you need is Blower, that's it. Once you have this, you've pretty much won the entire thing. I'm gonna keep the plants which are like good at stalling. Like chart garden and stuff. Um, you know what, I think one of the best, if not the best plants for that is gonna be the primal potato mine. We're gonna go with that. Uh, not the primal potato mine, the primal pea shooter, excuse me on that. And I'm gonna go take the spearmint. Do I... Am I already using it? Oh, wait, we are full. I can only take these many seed packets. Well, I guess this is it. So obviously you don't have to do the bonus objective. Oh, it was the straw burst. I think that's what it's called. I'm really not sure. I forgot how to use them. Okay, now I remember. <laughs> now, whenever you see the pennies, that base blast wave coming down, you need to place down the blower. That's it. That is the trick. So obviously I messed up. So I'm just gonna put down a primal potato mine. I'm gonna handle this. Primal potato mine takes out anything. And now just keep the blower in hand and keep it here. Base blast perk, just blower, that's it. This is the entire strategy. Okay, so now I use the blower and they are gone. This is it. This is unbeatable. Now I'm gonna be using the primal potato mine simply because I can. I'm gonna place this one down here. Now there's so much coming down. All I'm gonna do is blower. Because frankly I can't handle that. I'll be very honest with you. I cannot handle this. I really want... I really wanted to save my strawberry, uh, I don't remember its name, um, but I just couldn't. I need to keep them at bay, which is more important. Okay, before the strategy, I was like doing like very dumb stuff. I was just spending all my money and all those perks and powers. Turns out you don't need that. Again, major thanks to Shailendra Singh. Thanks man, I couldn't have figured it out without you. Okay, so now we are knocking everything back, which is amazing. See now, all I needed was that, um, what's that little plant? Time warp. If I had that, it would have been pretty much over for the zombies. It already is, but yeah, you get the point. Now, I wish I had a little bit of plant food cause, you know, I need, that's the only reason I was getting the iceberg lettuce in the first place. Yup, it works, it freezes. I'm not sure whether I can blow these guys back though. If I cannot, that's gonna be a little bit of an issue. Okay, I can. 
blower is overpowered blower is definitely overpowered and you know what i have no issues with that i didn't take shelindra singh's permission before uploading this so hopefully he's okay with it if you're not just comment down below shelindra i'll remove the video or something but hopefully i'm pretty sure he won't have an issue with it because obviously it's a strategy so anyone can use it <laughs> the blower is going to kill all of them as well the flying zombies you know in plants vs zombies 1 the blower wasn't actually this ridiculously overpowered it's just that i think ea took it a little bit too too literally like anything flying they were a little bit too literal with the definition anything which is like slightly in the air just goes away and it's amazing how i never used it and this is the only reason like that mint is like so powerful i don't remember the name of the mint but um i think it's like containment or something i'm really not sure about it but yeah there's a mint for that which basically pushes away zombies simply like this uh, perk penny spark you can call it so yeah this is all you need to, uh, this is all you need to do for this i mean it's amazing anyways i think i'll end it off here this is the strategy and i seriously hope you guys have unlocked the sap fling by now anyways yeah i think i'll end it off here there's nothing much to say anymore If you guys didn't enjoy please do leave a like and subscribe and as always thank you guys for watching and huge thanks to Shailendra Singh bye